お兄ちゃんがやってるカチカチってするのなら楽しいのかな Good day, ladies and gentlemen, it's out the little again. Yeah, we're back here again, New Vegas. How are you guys doing? And yeah, Willow and Sunny Smiles are looking at each other for some reason, I don't know. Okay, let's keep on moving then. Oh, yeah. Okay, so now that we got a plan on them chips,、uh, it's time for us to go to. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Distance. Personal space, girls. Alright, so let's go in there. I mean, you know. Yeah, hi, Victor.、Um, can I get in there? No? Well, howdy, partner. Good to see you again. Boss is waiting for you upstairs, so get a move on. Thank you, man. I see you brought a friend. Sorry, partner, but they're gonna have to stay outside. No problem, I head there by myself. Come back soon now. Whoa. Wow, this casino feels like a vault itself. Alright. Okay. Um. You guys stay here, alright? Uh, stay here, stay here. Where's the stay here? Wait here. Alright then. From you.、Where? You, wait here. <sighs> Why do I have to miss all the fun? I'm, I'm sorry. I'm accepted NCR rule. Some people will do anything to feel safe. You? Uh, no, stay here. Howdy.、Yeah. Hey, you there. I have a message for you. What? It's from Ambassador Crocker. Very important. Here you go. What? The ambassador, huh? Think maybe we should go talk to him? Ambassador? You mean the, um, NCR ambassador? Oh, I don't care. We, we, we need to talk to Mr. Hal first, alright? Then then we'll go to the ambassador or whoever the sitter is. Oh crap, it's so so fucking dark in here. Anyone turns on the light? Fuck me.、Oh, shit. Alright. Um. What? Where to, partner? Okay, get, let's go to、uh, Penthouse. Penthouse floor. Penthouse floor. Oh, hi. Jane. Oh, so there's a Secutron. Some of the security trons are like. They have special sort of AI personality, I guess. Security Tron Mark 1. Oh, okay. Yeah, I remember now. Mr. House is basically this guy. Haha. <laughs> You've been a busy courier, haven't you? You take your obligation to deliver a package very seriously, an ethic for which I am grateful. I will admit, when you ignored my invitation, I predicted negative outcomes. But you have a way of exceeding expectations, don't you? Well, enough. Let's have the chip then. Yeah. You know what? This is me. I deliver. Because, you know, this is my job. I have to be professional. Alright? So, if I were to see you without the stuff you asked me to bring you, it would be very unprofessional. So, here it is. Alright? Not so fast, Mr. House. We need to discuss payment.、Uh, yeah, discuss payment first. Fine. Give me the chip and I'll pay you four times the delivery bonus stipulated in your contract. How's that? Okay, that's good. That's good. 1000 caps. It's a small thing, isn't it? And yet so capacious. So very dear. Decades of hiring salvagers out west to search for this little relic in the ruins of a place called Sunnyvale. Back then, anyway. That's where the chip was printed on October 22nd, 2077. It was to have been hand delivered to me here at the Lucky 38 the next day. But the bombs fell first. Suffice it to say, the delivery was never made. So, you were from back then. Okay. What happened next? A great deal shall be happening. A cascade of events with you taking a central role. 
At the moment, however, all you need to do is take the elevator all the way down to the bottom level. You'll understand soon enough. Okay, so Mr. House, he has lived over the last 200 years. He lived past the last 200 years and he is actually living inside a computer. His body are being his body is being uh, preserved in a chamber in in, in a free, frozen chamber. Suffice to say that this guy is immortal now basically with the technology that he got. Step closer to the demonstration area if you would. I right. expect you're well familiar with my securitrons by now. Yeah, I know. The titanium alloy housing that protects its electronic core deflects small arms and shrapnel easily enough. Its X-25 Gatling laser produced to spec by Glassinghouse Inc. is deadly against soft targets at medium range. And for close range suppression or crowd control, the Securitron is armed with a 9mm submachine gun. All of this you probably already knew. What you did not know is that these are the Securitron's secondary weapons. All this time, my Securitrons have had to get by running the Mark I operating system, which lacked software drivers for their primary weapons. I see. Oh, Today, yeah. with the delivery of the Platinum chip, all that changes. Behold, for the first time, Securitrons running the Mark II OS. The M-235 missile launcher gives the Securitron the ability to engage ground and air targets at significantly longer ranges. And a rapid-fire G-28 grenade launcher ensures the Securitron is deadly in close-range engagements. The software upgrade also includes drivers for the Securitron's highly sophisticated on-board auto-repair systems. Altogether, the Mark II software upgrade confers a 235% increase in combat effectiveness per unit. The city of New Vegas finally has soldiers worthy of protecting it. Return to the penthouse now. We have much to discuss. Yep, so that is what the chip is all Trips about. to the basement are rarely so educational, don't you think? Well, I've since broadcast the upgrade to every Securitron in range of my transmitters, and I must say, it's causing quite a stir down on the strip. Alright, so what happens next? Why are you showing your hand like that? Now your enemies know what you're up to. You think your Securitrons can defeat Kaiser Legion and Enzir? Well, actually you can. Because those stuff don't feel pain, and they receive inf they, re they just listen to orders very, very well. Why show your hand like that? Yeah, basically, I would. If I were you, I would just, you know, you know, install all these drivers without letting them know, or maybe install all those drivers without letting them sort of like know and and fuse what's going on. Then, so it's like you know, so the next time when you want to like when they want to do anything to you, you you you'll be able to show your hand. I'm surprised you can still underestimate me after everything you've seen. Yeah, basically. I haven't shown my hand. I've shown one card. I've given my enemies a single provocative datum upon which to fixate. They have no idea what other cards I'm holding. It's a strong hand, believe me. I dealt it to myself. Alright. Sure, if you say that you still have some artist stuff. To secure the future of New Vegas, I must have your assistance. The work ahead is dangerous, but you weather danger well. I'm listening. The next step will require you to infiltrate Caesar's camp at Fortification Hill. You want me to kill Kaiser? Are you insane? Absolutely not. Caesar is of great use to me. What? I don't want you harming a hair on that man's head. Assuming you could find one. So what do you want me to do at Fort Hill? I mean, going to the fort sounds insane. He already invited me to the fort. Well, yeah, he invited me to the fort, so yeah, maybe I can deliver the news to you. Because let's talk business here. I'm I'm a courier, right? A courier. I'm not surprised. The Legion has spies on the strip. Okay, so I'll go to the fort as you ask. What's in it for me? What will I find at Kaiser's Legion camp? 
mean, I mean, you want me to go there to find something, or you want me to, to find someone? I want you to open a hatch in the basement of the derelict weather station atop Fortification Hill. You'll recognize it on sight. The hatch bears the logo of the Lucky 38, same as the Platinum chip. How do I open it? You can't, but the chip can. The hatch will recognize the Platinum chip and open sesame. Alright, so... sure. Something very important. I wouldn't want to spoil the surprise, so don't bother asking. Alright, I'll do as you ask. Uh, sure. Here, take the Platinum chip again. You will need it. Upon arrival at the fort, it's likely that you'll be searched and the chip taken from you. Don't worry, it will come back to you. Okay. Um, do we get to talk more? Make your way to Caesar's camp at Fortification Hill. Something very interesting awaits you. Be advised, the Lucky 38 is not open to the general public. Trespassers will be shot. Thank you. So do we go down now? Congratulations, partner. The boss has instructed me to come you to the high roller suite. You can bring your friends too. Be like a little clubhouse for the gang you put together. Just bear in mind, you're the only one who gets to see the boss. Any friends you got, they can wait in the suite. Enjoy the digs, partner. They're plenty fancy. All right, so let's have a look at a cocktail suite. Okay, so this is the cocktail suite. Pretty cool. Um, yeah, presidential suite. So it's the same stuff as what Benny offered. Oh, the whole place is very, very dimly lit. Dimly lit. I don't want to live in a place that is so dark in here. No. But there's a whole lot of stuff around. That's good. I mean, you have you get to live a lot of place like that. So, you know. But it's very, very dark. Upgrade a suite? Nah, I don't care. Because... It's, it's too dimly... I don't want that. I, I don't want to be here. Where to, partner? Let's just go down there to the casino and go back and get our friends. Because, you know... Casino floor! Casino floor! Alright, let's go. A lot of exposition yet again, so... <laughs> Yeah, exposition, exposition, exposition. You know what? Oh, strip fame gain. That's Excuse good. Excuse me, but are you the courier who caused all of that trouble in the tops? E what do you want to know? Oh, well, I heard, I mean, we heard, we meaning the followers <laughs> of the apocalypse, that you had been in there. The Lucky 38, I mean. And we were wondering if you could help us. If it's not too much trouble, of course. How do you get enough money to enter the street, by the way? Because the followers don't seem to be the wealthy bunch. This is important enough to the followers that we scraped together the caps required for the credit check. And I'm staying at Vault 21, which is pretty cheap, for the strip anyway. What does it involve that oh, you want great. me to go, what you want the me to do? The followers of the apocalypse, well, some of us anyway, have been interested in Mr. House's technology. How he stays alive. Of course, no one else is allowed inside the Lucky 38, so no one knows what's going on. Well, except for you. And this is where I come in. Right. We just want to find out what sort of technology Mr. House has used to stay alive for all these years. It could be of great benefit to the people we try to help, many of whom suffer from hard to diagnose illnesses. Dr. Leon, outdated diagnosis is a terminal low <laughs> discussion of caps. No, I. It's okay. If it's helping out people, I'm on it. Really? Oh. I wasn't expecting you to agree so easily. That's great. Here, take this packet sniffer. It'll allow us to intercept data on Mr. House's network. You might have to manually remove the encryption from his data network, but hopefully you won't have too much trouble. Good luck. Alright. Um, let's go in again then. Ah, <sighs> more work to do. Alright, uh, let's see. The quest says... The moon comes over the tower. Buck and access point to the lucky 38 hour. Okay, okay. 
Let's see. Lucky 38 Network. One, there are so many terminals around, so let's not go to the ones in the front because they would notice. Yeah, there we go. There's one terminal here. Oh, it's locked. Fuck. Uh, Sonic screwdriver. Oh, Sonic rifle. I get a second one? Okay. Hold on. I need a hack. There we go. Easy peasy. Emily. Hey, have you been able to bug Mr. House's network yet? Yep, I have bucket for you. It looks like we started getting reports from the tower's network. I'm sure the others will be able to make some sense of this. Oh, what the hell? The bug went offline. Damn it. I swear to God that old man has thought of everything. Well, it looks like this was all for nothing. But you did your best. I appreciate the help. What? But at least you got some data, right? At least you got some data, right? Oh, hi. Thanks again for helping us with that data. I mean, the feed only lasted about 30 seconds, and it's not that useful, but... Well, we tried. Wasn't that a u- why, why wasn't it useful? We were connected for half a minute, and received enough data to fill five holodisks. It looked like nonsense at first, but we decoded it. It was all biometric data, life signs from Mr. House. The technology he's using is so advanced that it samples data hundreds of times per second. Okay. It's fascinating, but depressing. Whatever technology he has can't possibly be practical for the people out here. How long have you been with the followers? About five years now. I have family back in Arroyo. But this is where all the good work is being done, so to speak. NCR taxes and inflation have been hard for a lot of people to deal with. And most of the money is going to the war effort. There's not much funding for medical research with OSI or any other group. Not unless it has a military application, anyway. Right, so basically, NCR today, it feels more like a Trump's America. <laughs> because Trump, if you read his books, I do. I do read, I, I do read both um, Trump's and also Clinton's. Like, Clinton as in, not Bill Clinton, but Hillary Clinton's. I, I read both Hillary Clinton books and Donald Trump's books. And Donald Trump's books is very, very military-ish. He wants to spend money on military. He wants to make sure that America's borders are being strengthened, you know. But it at the expense of possibly the normal lives of people. Because he feels that you have to defense, you have to up your defense first before you go and take care of your people's needs. So what do you do around here? Is there any other way to get Mr. House data? Uh, is there any other way? After two tries, I think I've learned enough. I'm sure there's something more promising I could be helping the other followers with. Uh, oh yeah. I didn't tell you about the first time. I'd rather not talk about it if you don't mind. Okay, sure, but I, I, I risk a lot of stuff to get your data. True. Alright. The first try was a little less professional. Someone important on the Strip had access to some of House's technology. Specifically, a Securitron. And more specifically, the someone was Benny. I know, I know, he shot you in the head and everything. But this was a while ago. I knew he was sleazy, but I didn't realize he was so cold-blooded. Did Benny say he had security front? He sure didn't. Benny was pretty tight-lipped and cryptic about the thing. But he did let me poke around in it for a while. I wound up helping Benny a lot more than he helped me. Once he had access to the Securitron's memory banks, he kicked me out of the tops. Big surprise, right? Should have seen that coming. So how do you have you do? The Securitron was disabled somehow. Might have been an EMP given some of the damage I saw. Anyway, he wanted it re-enabled and connected to Mr. House's data network. The trick was getting it to be invisible on the network. If Mr. House detects a rogue Securitron in his system, he remotely fries it. Getting around that security feature was a bit tricky. You didn't think to tell someone about this as well? Yeah, strange as it sounds, I figured that badmouthing one of the Strip's most powerful people wasn't a good idea. The only reason why I'm telling you any of this is because he's gone now. Yeah, I kill him. 
All right, so she from area, guys. Welcome, someone from uh, Fallout Two. Fallout Two in the ending, um, our main character actually founded Arroyo. So, so she's basically, you know, one of the people that that was born in there. So it's pretty cool. See you when I see you. All right, so I guess that's enough exposition, and let's keep on going, guys. Okay. Follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Yeah, let's go. So, where should we go now next? I don't know where should we go next. I mean, you know what? I'm not going out yet. All right, I I want to go and and explore around here. It's new. It's it's Vegas. Sure, later. Technically, I I never really really go to like. You know Vegas before. Of course, I played this game. I I've been to New Vegas a lot of times, but just this... lost a month's caps. Oh my God! What? I'm sorry. I feel so sorry for you guys. I'm sorry. So let's just explore around a bit. All right. Let's go to the other end of whatever it is, and then we explore from there. What? Oh oh. Okay, that's Vault Twenty One. It's just a small shack though, but down there is a vault, so that's why it, it can become a hotel, I understand that. And that is the... Ambassador place, I guess, alright. And Michelangelo's workshop. Oh, hi. Evening. Michelangelo workshop, let's go in here because... Maybe there's something to see here? Well, the whole place is very, very badly lit. I mean, this this game has a little needs to work on a little bit on its indoor lighting. Mm, oh, you're wearing a red one. Hi. Hey. Hey. Hi. What can I do for you? Yeah. I, I, who is Michael Angelo? He's the reason the strip shines like a star at night. Mike's imagined and built every sign, billboard, and light you'll see around here. So where can I find him? Check out the back of the shop. He's usually working there. All right. Bye. Back of the shop? You mean here? No. You mean here, right? This guy, right? Oh yeah. Oh, hello. I am Michelangelo. How can I? Uh, wait. Are you here to deliver more billboard <laughs> requests? Please tell me you're not a messenger on behalf of Mr. House. No, I haven't. Of course I am on behalf of Mr. House. <laughs> no, I'm not here for anything like that. Who are you? Why are you so jittery about Mr. House? Because spending myself to the edge of artistic oblivion for Mr. House sums up my existence since I had to leave Vault 21. That's why. You live in Vault 21? Tell me about that. An artist's rare thing to see. What's your story? Well, I... Uh, not much, really. Vault 21 was my home. My dear home. I left it to explore the outside world. At first it was a marvel to behold. My inspiration flowed true and its works caught Mr. House's attention. And that's how I ended up in this place. It sounds as if you don't like this place. What is wrong? I feel haunted by something terrible. Working in such a huge workshop often makes me shiver. I can't even leave the strip. So is this fear of the outside world draining your inspiration? Yes, I think so. But please, uh, keep quiet about it. Without inspiration, I'm as good as a tumbleweed drifting in the barren wasteland. You, you expect clear symptoms of acute agoraphobia. I can help. Ah, an educated fellow. Now that is almost as rare as artistry. So, how can you help me regain my inspiration? Several years of psychoanalysis and a few thousand caps a month will fix you. I know this guy in Freeside really good at tree trepanation. No, grow up here and go out of the real world to find your inspiration. I could escort you into the wasteland, it's not so bad. Yeah, and we already have two guns, you know, escorting us already, so might as well. Thank you for the offer, but I think I really can't go to see... 
Wait a minute. I know, I don't have to necessarily be there to see it. What do you mean? I mean, you're not making this easy, screw it. Well, what do you mean? Yes, you? yes, that's it. I have a camera. It is old, but it should work. Perhaps you could bring me images of inspiring landmarks. Camera? Camera still work after 200 years after the world is scotch? Okay. I'll help you. Do you have any landmarks in mind? Mickey photography is a risky business. This is going to cost you a lot. And you know I'm tired of this. I think I'll just beat you senseless instead. Alright. I'll help you. Do you have any landmarks in mind? I've always wanted to see the dinosaur and its thermometer sign at Novak. Then there's the famous Bison Steve sign. The McCarran Airfield and the Helios One Power Station signs are of much interest to my work. Like the Sunset Sarsaparilla Headquarters bottle. Wow, there's so many stuff, huh? Alright. Okay, you got the deal. I'll return with the pictures then. Thank you. I really can't thank you enough for this. Please, get me all the pictures. I'll compensate you accordingly. Oh, and if you need more camera film, then just come back and I'll get it for you. Again, thank you. Alright, Kodak R9000. What? Begin recording. Navarro Outpost Scientist, I am glad that EDE has reached you. You will find several data banks of information on this machine. What is going on? Please handle this information with the utmost care as it represents the sum total of the results of my research on the Duraframe iBots. There are also several data banks with information on my research into Poseidon Energy and some projects they were working on in the Mojave area. All right, that's uh, Eddie. You you need to be careful about you know this loading this thing like halfway like that. It scared the shit out of people. It can sh it can scare people. All right, that's what I'm saying. Oh, hello, assistant. Oh, you you leaving your rack out in the open? I can see your rack over there. All right, so now I have like uh, a few things to go. First thing first, let's go to Novak. I mean, okay, they're give they're giving me all sort of like. Okay, let's go to Chemicarin. Oh yeah, because that's the um, airport. Okay. Sure, let's go to the airport and have a look. Oh, there's a trader. Hi. Hello. Uh huh. Oh, I don't get a trade with you. Okay, this is a Karen guard. Okay. So that's the Ray L Ray Motel. Okay, so I think since Ambassador want to see me, so I have a little bit of special access here. Should be okay. Do you get homesick when you go into an NCR held location? I sure do. Alright, so, oh my god, it's laggy a little bit here. Okay, can I just go to the airfield? I mean, there must be something here. Hold on, hold on, do I... What? Oh, he only wants to look at the sign. Okay, okay. R9000. I'm a tourist. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry for, for trespassing. Um, uh, I'm sorry, okay? Let's just, uh, you know. I'm sorry. I'm stupid sometimes. I don't know what's wrong with me. Okay? Sometimes I'm just being an idiot. Alright, so... There we go. And then, uh, we need to go to the Bison Steve... Place. Just right there. So, so let's go. Alright, so, uh, the game crashed. So, it's pretty not good over here. It's like, I don't know what's wrong. The game is, like, not loading this area properly just now, so... And here it is. The, the the this is not the the hotel that he that he wanted, but this is the sunset social sp sasa sasa parilar 
uh, bottle that I think he wants. So, yeah, let's take this and go. And the whole area is flooded with enemies, so we better run because, yeah, I don't want people to start it, get it getting. I don't want my people to get engaged with the enemies just yet. All right, so next one, let's go. Um, he said that he want to go and see Novak. Oh, Helios one. Okay, let's let's go to Helios one because Helios one is great. Helios one is good. Oh man, oh oh that sound yet again. Jesus. Oh, hey, yeah. Hi, Tardis. Okay, hold on. There we go. And then let's go to uh, Prim. Yes, Prim has got that Bison Hotel thinging. So let's go and take the picture of that hotel too. Which is a long time since we go back there and, and talk to Nelson already. So... Bison Steve Hotel. Here we go, man. Nice. And it's nighttime, so I, I doubt he wants to talk to me. Everyone's sleeping. And you guys need to clear like clear this body because it's very, 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 very Ugh. You know? Ugh. Alright, and then Novak. What? Uh Novak's dinosaur. Let's get a good clear picture of that. Da -da -da -da. And it's sign. Novak. There we go. There we go. We're done. Okay. That sounds that 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 was easy enough, man. All right, so let's go. Whew. It feels really nice to have to to after having like finish up your your a really good quest, you know, having a good quest run is pretty nice. All right, we're back here. Oh. It's a really really fast trip anyway, so not too much of an issue. I hope Angelo likes, you know, the picture because you were able to hey, I got you the picture and don't you go and sleep. Aha. The brave photographer returns. Good to see you. Yeah, yeah, good to see you. I have, I have the fresh pictures for you. Oh, Everything. that's wonderful. Just what I need. Thank you, brave one. Here's some compensation for your work. I took all the pictures you wanted. There was something about a reward. You have earned it, my friend. Now I can finally unveil my masterpieces to the world, all thanks to you. Come visit me again sometime. All right. So you, ha you, ha you need some time to work on that stuff, I guess. Fine. It's um sure. Let's just wait here. Hello. I'll just wait here, okay? And um yeah, I'll just wait here and and for for let's just wait here for for a few hours and see if he you know, give us that reward or something. 9 10 11 12 1 2 3 4 5 Okay, and I need to sleep, man. God damn it. Oh yeah, and I need to go out and wait, not here. Stupid me. I'm being stupid sometime. I'm sorry. Let's wait for another 13 hours and that will be like 24 hours, right? Oh yeah. Bum ba bum bum ba bum bum ba bum 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 Okay I am tired I am tired and I need sleep I need I need I need water I need a lot of shit Morning Morning Good morning Alright here we go Hey man Aha the brave photographer returned so nothing yet. Okay. 
I guess you don't really have more stuff from me, I guess. Let's wait for another 10 hours. Let's see. Let's just see if there's anything that he can give me. Hunger level. Oh my god. I could die. What? Where's that guy? Oh yeah, here you are. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, basically he doesn't have any more um, follow-ups. No more. It's okay, we're just gonna leave it as that. Alright? Oh yeah, it's okay. So, uh, yeah, basically I am hungry and I need... Um, I need flavor this, I need grill mantis, a ghetto fruit, uh purified water. There we go. Oh I still I'm still thirsty, okay. And then of course we need to go and get some sleep. Interested in taking me out for a drink in one of the casinos? No. That might be fun. No. I need to sleep right now. I just need some sleep, okay? I'm sorry. Ba -ba -da -ba. Of course, I know I need to go and see Kaiser at a moment, but no, no, okay. Oh yeah, uh, there's a street Howdy. vendor. Interested in a refreshing beverage or a tasty snack? Yeah. Uh, what do you sell? Non-alcoholic beverages and snack foods. The casinos <laughs> get to sell booze. No one else does. Yeah, I get it. Of course. I've got a special discount for special people like you. All right, so uh, I need. Okay, I'll I'll have some of this cram as well. Maze is good because you say you have water. I don't see water. Banana yunka is, but no. All right. Uh, you know what? I'll just give you something else. All right. Pulse granite rat slayer. I'll I'll need the rat slayer. I don't think you can pay me for those. How about this? 9mm pistol. I bet this thing is uh, important for you. No, 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 I need that. Caravan shotgun. There we go. Go quietly. The Legion can count on that. And then we need to repair this thing because the game crashed just we now. Go so. Quietly. The Legion can count on that. Alright, so now next step is going to find something, somewhere to sleep. Ugh. I know there's a like there's like presidential suite over there, so let's go up there in the like like. Nah, I don't want to. Let's go back to the TARDIS. I mean, I I I prefer to have TARDIS with me. So guys, uh, I'm sorry if this thing is gonna be creeping you guys out, but but I'm sorry. Oh wait, I don't have the upgrade for TARDIS summoning yet. Jesus. Okay, let's go back to. Where was it again? No, 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 no. I want to go to the hideous one, yes. Uh, hello? Hi, are you there? Oh, right. You can't respond. What? Listen, I'm using your robot as a relay to get this message to you. I've picked up some unusual chatter regarding your robot. It seems that it has some information that we could use. Oh, wait, where are my manners? This is Lorenzo, a knight with the Brotherhood of Steel. Okay. We'd be very interested in examining your tech. Could you bring your robot to one of our patrols so they can examine it? I'll have the robot mark the location on your map. I don't care, alright? Find a patrol knight Lorenzo told you about to the Brotherhood of Steel. No, 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 I don't care. I'm sorry. Uh, I need to sleep, okay? But, if I'm not mistaken, if I wait for like another two hours... No. Yeah, basically that's it. Alright, let's just... Um... Get some sleep. I mean, you know. 
<laughs> I'm tired, okay? My character is tired and he needs sleep. It's not something I can help it. Oh, and the game is loading a lot, lot longer than usual. What? Okay, now this time we have phone calls. Where's the phone? System readouts, uh, fuck me. Hold on, I need to go and look at this system scanner, miss control, telepathic circuits. Where is the fucking. Oh, NAFCOM? No. No, 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 no. If it's in the other type, then it's easy. Like, but this one is. I don't know where is the phone call, the, 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 the phone pinging. So you know what? Um, okay, let's go with system scanner and let's switch to advanced mode, no architecture reconfiguration, primary console room, uh, let's go with copper. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh that was fast, okay. Copper and we have phone. Where's the phone? I remember there's a phone somewhere here. Now that's the system scanner. No, 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 no. Where's the phone? God damn it. Guys, do you see where's the phone? That's the fast. Oh, there we go. Communicator. Set com alert alien invasion at Prim. What? Invading enemy wants to take over the earth and only you can stop them. Ignoring a plea for help will have negative consequences for your relationship with the people of Novak. Okay. Earth Defender. It's time for me to go back out there and help people out. Okay. Um. Let's go with the classic yet again. Classic. You know what? You know what? I need to go and sleep, man. I need to sleep, alright? Alright, let me just get a little bit of shut eye first. Before we go and do something stupid, okay? I mean, it's like midnight. Now we can go out there and help out people. Um, of course, I would need to get something to drink first. We need water, so that's 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 what it is. Water, 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 water. There we go. All right. Um, what? No, who closed the door? No one closed the door, okay? Alright, let's go and help out Prim. Alright, we're now at Prim and I saw a lot of Daleks in front of us. That's not good. Let's, uh... uh use... Pulse grenades. Shit. All right, all right. That's that's totally not cool. Not good at all. Um, can I have? Okay. Nurse, be careful. Ah, ah. Oh, 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 oh! My God. I'm dead. I would die very easily here. God damn it. Um, steam pack. Okay, this is definitely not cool because I would die like in a heartbeat. What the fuck? 
Oh no, Willow's unconscious right now. That's not good. Eddie, no! Oh my god, no! I cannot have that. I can't have that, alright? I can't have that. Jesus. Alright, you know what? Um... Eddie, you stay here. Stay here, stay here. Just stay here, okay? Stay here. Don't, don't, don't be stupid, alright? Okay, you know what? Uh, I think we need to get ourselves ready. Alright, so let's just, uh... Yeah. Let's hope no one dies. I mean, I, I would really hate it if some of the NPC died. Oh wow, they are very, 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 very sturdy. Ow, 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 fuck me. God damn it. Alright, alright. Uh, Willow got hurt just now. That's not good. No! What? Alright, this is not good because... I keep having my friends died and I couldn't have that. Alright. Oh my god, these are Daleks, these are Daleks, so far the only one, the only one, so far the only one person that can die. Okay, so let's just use uh, some of the lightweight armor and uh, let's go with code one m one a one alright, so... That would work, and Eddie would have to survive because I don't want him to die. Eee. Wow, this is this is a very very tough one. Shit, it's a Dalek. There, there is an, a Dalek army. It's a fucking Dalek army, and I don't like that. Okay, okay. What? Okay, added it to a drug. That's not good too. Oh, fuck. Ah, ah. Shit. Shit, man. This, these fuckers are very strong. Oh my god. I shouldn't have picked up that 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 fucking Nafcom thingy. Ah, oh, man. It's basically my 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 I'm so doomed, man. Oh crap. Guys, uh no, 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 don't stand in their way because you will get, you get obliterated like very fast. Yeah, as seen over there. Ah, shit, I am out of ammo too. Out of ammo, out of everything, so that's uh, that's definitely a good one. That's definitely a good sign. I hate this man. Oh my god! Next time we should never. Ah man! There we go. <laughs> Yeah, this is bad. I mean, this is a very, very bad uh, quest. I don't think we can, we can. I don't think we can deal with this. I mean, this is going to be very, very hard. 
yeah, it's gonna be very, very hard, man. I mean, this is stupid. I mean, I'm, I'm so dead. But you know what? There's one way for us to heal, to deal with this. We can bring one robot army with us as well. One fucking robot army. So let's do it. Um, Crimson Caravan. No, 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 no. Yes, let's go to Australian Robotics. They have robots. We can deal with them with robots as well. So let's try it out. Let's see if we can bring a lot of robots. Damn it! What? Why there's some enemy in here as well? What? Do not be alarmed. Order will be restored soon. What? Oh yeah. Now we go. I've killed that rat. What? Why are you destroying our own robots? Shit. Okay. Yeah, uh, I need you to give me uh, some ro robot stuff. Alright. Robot, 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 robot. Where's that? thing eight yeah robot spare part we need that thank you more thank you new recommend jump call robotic suits now weapons oh yeah that's it that's good so what can I? Oh man, there are so many things that I can do. That Assemblatrons, uh, Metal Armor, Pack Mr. Handy, Pack Protectron, Metal Armor. I don't have Metal Armor. Energy Cells, I don't really have those. Dog, Cyber Dog, Hoverdor, uh, Mini Target Bots, that is actually useful. But I need 9mm machine gun. Ah shit. Ah shit. Well, you know what? Let's get whatever the shit that is right here. Repair him. What? I don't have anything to repair him? My god. I don't have the parts to repair? Really? Okay, here it is. Um, maybe you can sell me something that is already there. Like, for example... No... Rock... No, these are upgrades. I need like... Shit. You don't have... Okay, Broken Mr. Handy. At least we have that one. Okay. So let's get that Broken Mr. Handy out. Why? I, I thought we have the parts to repair this. Really? Is this gonna be whatever it is? Oh my god. Okay. What do I need to repair them again? I don't remember. Me too. Okay, at least we have an iBot. Packed iBot added. Yay! At least we have that. Okay, you know what? I need a lot more stuff. I mean, I need like uh, robot spare parts. I need fission battery. I need robot brains. I need a lot of stuff. Shit. So let's go back to Gibson Grave, uh, Gibson Scrapyard, not Graveyard. Those that girl that that aunt actually have some really good stuff. She can help me out over here. I think I think she actually sells a lot of stuff like like that pack robots and all that. So that actually work, right? So you're back. Happy. Okay, so what we call that? Broken Securitron. Oh, I need this. 
Enclave, fish and battery, robot, robot spare part. Do you have that? No. Oh man. Oh shit. No, this is bad. Oh shit, man. And I don't know. I don't have stuff to repair the robots. That's not good. Dang. Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, so I didn't really like get any repaired bots. My brothers, Sam and Dean, once hunted down a giant gecko that was terrorizing the grazing grounds in Klamath. They got a big reward for it. Shut up. I know you're referring to the supernatural thing, but it doesn't matter. All right. Now I have stationed these robots here a long time ago because the uh, the Legion Union keep coming here and ambush people. Now that they they are okay with us, I'm thinking that maybe it's okay for these goons to follow me at the moment. All right, because I need them. I need them to follow me. Five out of seven. Uh, let's see if we can have. Uh, you, you, you have a zap fist. Yeah, so. That's gonna be fun. We can only bring like seven of them, so probably I will still get killed, but we'll see. The problem here is like, I, in this New Vegas um, version of, New, of Fallout, we don't really have... We don't really have um, the ability to, to sprint, so that's why it's going to be a little bit tougher than usual. Alright, so let's get light-weighted armor, and you go out and... You go out and, and be aggressive, come on. Uh, use melee, and then be aggressive, come on. No, be aggressive. Kill the guys. Yeah, there we go. That's one down. Uh, purified water. I need more of those. I got you now. Oh, that is dead. Two Daleks. Take it down. Take it down. Take that one down. Come on. All right, nice. There's more. There's more. Come on. Uh, we need. I need more of this. Take it out. Take it out. Take it out. Yes. Invader strongholds are unique dungeons. They are accessible for 24 hours only after an invasion attempt. Really, you can travel to the relevant dungeon whilst there. May free captive humans, loot rare items, and even destroy the stronghold by overloading its power source. And then, then they will not come and disturb us, right? Alright. Ooh. Alright, that's, uh... Okay. I think it's time for us to call it a day, because this is nuts. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you guys in the next episode. In the next episode, I'll remember to go back and get Sunny Smiles and everyone back. Okay, I'll see you guys there. Ooh, Willow, that was like... Ugh. Yeah, yeah, I know that. Right, robots? Thank you, good work, good job.